Hey everyone, what is going on? So I wanted to make a short video discussing the new PvP mechanics where you have to like swipe your finger and get all those like icons instead of the three rings. Now, for the most part I do like it. I really do. I think it's it really adds to the game. It's really fun uh, than just going for three rings. So for the most part, I think a majority of the community has been happy with it. Some people, maybe not so much, maybe it takes time to learn all 18 types. And that's totally cool, but there is one problem I've noticed. Now, it could either be looked at as a problem, or it could be looked at as just a new type of strategy that you can use to get an advantage on your opponent. Okay, so let's say you have a fortress out, and I have, uh, let's say, a lantern, right? And then you click on your charge move. It gives you five seconds to decide if you want to shield now. So with the earthquake, you have to slide your finger across the ground, Kind of like an earthquake, right? And with heavy slam, you have to swipe like an X. So let's say I'm looking at my opponent and I see them swiping an X. I'm going to know that it's heavy slam. So I'm going to know that I should should not shield that lantern because it's going to uh, not be an earthquake and it's not going to do a lot of damage to me. If I see them rubbing their finger across the like the bottom of the screen, I'm going to know that's an earthquake. I'm like, well, it's not a bluff. I should shield that. So, yeah, you could look at this as either one or two ways. You could look at it like, well, that's bad. You know, a lot of people are going to get an advantage. Or you could look at it as a new type of strategy in a way, right? Kind of like switching mid-game or switching during the charge move, right? Uh, you could look at it like that. So let me know what you guys think. Have you noticed this uh, in any of your battles? I personally haven't used it in my tournament today. I haven't been trying to focus on my opponent's. Um, you know, the way they, they tap the screen, but it could really be interesting once you get all 18 memorized. It could really be interesting, and, you know, I know that happened in the battle today. That's why that brought up the, the discussion with all of us, and, you know, again, you know, it doesn't... I don't know if it necessarily bothers me, but it could, it could give your opponent... It will give your opponent an advantage for those who memorize what move you're using, right? So if they, if they memorize the specific ways to tap your finger or move your finger or whatever it happens to be and they know it's a bluff they're not going to shield that so it, it's really a good discussion and as i said i'm going to keep this video short but i want to hear what you guys have to say uh have, have you thought about this at all have you talked about it with anybody uh it, it is really interesting but again, it could just be strategy for those that can memorize all those different types, can use it to their advantage. But for those that maybe can't uh, or don't memorize every single type, maybe they won't use it that much, you know, maybe. Uh, but it, it, it all depends. If you're sitting right across from your opponent in a tournament, that's when it could affect you. Of course, if you're battling people, you know, online, like I'm battling, if I'm battling other YouTubers, you know, it, that's not going to matter at all. You have to be in person. So this really would only affect you in a tournament setting, but it can definitely affect you. So uh, let me know what you guys think. Uh, if you like this kind of quote unquote new strategy, let me know in the comments down below if you hate it, uh, if you've used it. I want to hear what you guys have to say about it. So yeah, I will see you in the next video, guys. That's going to be it for this one. Have a good day. Bye. Thank you so much for watching my latest video. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and don't forget to follow me on Twitter. If you like this video, click on one of the links to check out another one of my videos that you'll probably enjoy.